Right now we're in the kitchen with Chef Judy, and she outdone herself oh. with all the oh. berries you could find. I know. Doesn't it look pretty? Oh, my oh, goodness. Oh, it smells wonderful. I, oh, it so really does. My nose. I, that you were, had mentioned earlier, boy, the berries are really, the aroma is yeah. really strong, yeah. and they are because they're right at their peak. So let's start over here to the Glen Family Bakery. I mean, she started out making these beautiful cheesecakes, and look at the size of oh, the strawberries. I mean, right? I just, just she's known for her <laughs> strawberry cheesecake. I've had them at dinner parties. They're fantastic. Mm -hmm. Blueberry scones and blackberry scones are two of my favorite. Now mm. look at the blackberry lime scones. And she said it really makes a difference when you give a squeeze of lime on that. Mm -hmm. And I like that tartness in with the sweet of the berry. So big, beautiful scones. She's at the farmer's market that's over by um, the Polytech. Okay. Institute on Saturday mornings, and oh, she okay. supplies a lot of different restaurants as well. And look at this mixed berry pie. Is that Amazing. not? Oh. It's a work of art, and yeah, I, I'm going to feel guilty when I stick my fork in it. <laughs> right, but right, right. nonetheless, I will stick my fork. And when in. are we doing that? Not that okay. <laughs> Five minutes, <laughs> okay. sweetie, and counting. Okay. Now, pie licious. I've talked about her before. I've had her on the show from Northport. She's a cottage industry. She's a teacher by day. Oh. And she makes these unbelievable pies and she won Best Bakery of the Year in Northport. And what you can often do is say like you live in Venice, you can meet her part way mm -hmm. and she'll, oh, she'll wow, drive up there and meet you. But that. she has a strawberry rhubarb pie, traditional uh. blueberry, mixed berry, and cherry. But what I love is she always has a name for her different pies. Like, I cannot tell a lie, it's a cherry pie. Mm -hmm. And I Okay, so I have one on, for you. Right? Judy better not lie. There's a piece missing out of that pie. <laughs> I have no idea what happened. Just I think it came in that it way, me, but I hope me. there's not blueberry on my teeth. I have no idea. <laughs> that is funny. I love that, Bo Beth, you asked me, what is that? Yes, that is know. rhubarb. And oh, really? Stephanie, coming from the Midwest, knows we're coming into the rhubarb season. Mm. Blueberries now, then rhubarbs. Rhubarb is that bitter taste, but it marries so well with strawberries. Mm -hmm. It kind of cuts the balance. sweetness. And I'll tell you, you can't grow it here. I've you tried. Can't. It's you expensive really, yeah. to buy because right. they have to import it. But exactly. It's worth it. But we're going over to Yoder's, and of course everybody oh, knows. Yoders. I mean, oh, if you're going to have pie, you have to have Yoders, right? That's right. <laughs> exactly. And you know, they have fresh berries right at their produce shop, and of course, their infamous strawberry whipped cream pie that mm -hmm. everybody loves. Blueberry pie, blueberry crumb pie, oh. strawberry rhubarb pie, red <laughs> raspberry pie. And let the record show that Dave Tureen, the cameraman, has owed me a blueberry pie from Yoder's for two years on a bat. <laughs> and he cannot count this pie. We'll take this to him and he can give it to right. go I'm in. just saying, go for it. Now start eating for sure. Bonefish Grill, one okay. of the Seven. only restaurants that serves a true traditional yeah, strawberry shortcake for mm. dessert. And we're talking the southern with the biscuit mm -hmm. and the cream and an abundance of fresh strawberries. And I love that. And I'm, mm. I implore restaurants that we live in Florida. We should have strawberry shortcake on our menu. Mm -hmm. So great dessert from Bonefish Grill. And I Grill. may or may not have already been sampling off the back side of this one. I'll tell you why <laughs> oh, I no, love you this. Have. I have. You definitely I have. have. <laughs> <laughs> missing a whole this is not overly sweet. That's so when what you're I looking for that it. dessert that isn't like sugar over the top, mm -hmm. they've done a great job letting those berries be the Haven't highlight. They? And you can share mm. that. I mean, that honestly this is, is enough for three or four people at the table. So you get that, that sweet bite. I love this dessert. And then, of course, there's Sift Bakehouse. And I love her. And she just keeps expanding into more things. Soon we'll have her on for her new donut shop. But she is known for this Lucy Me cake. It was her grandma's recipe. It's a buttermilk vanilla cake cake with fresh raspberries and a cream Aww, cheese frosting. That's nice. Peach blueberry cream cheese coffee cakes. I wow. mean, does that just not wow. sound like I just want to put my jammies on right, right now and have a big mug of coffee and have that? It's so delicious. And of course, she has a blueberry lemonade scone. Oh, that's and oh, you really my. need to try it with that glaze, and you really get oh, that I'm lemon in it. Mm -hmm. To me, blueberries and lemon are the perfect mm -hmm. marriage. I love having them together. So Great varieties of wonderful, wonderful this berry is desserts. This is you tried it. Isn't that yeah, lovely? And, and the blackberry Isn't is that delicious. lovely? Mm -hmm. So I'm really excited because Very it really nice. gave us a large variety. And like I said, Florida strawberry season is basically just 
just about over this week. We're this going week? to blueberry season, mm -hmm. and then we'll be getting raspberries and blueberries soon from Maine. Okay, oh, we'll be yeah. watching those. I know the Mayaka blueberries are in the markets right now. I'm so. so excited, and they are coming in very sweet. Yes. So definitely pick up the local blueberries. All, All right. right. We, we are in our so berry cool. heaven. And remember, this I'm is one of the food to. groups, girls. It is perfectly yes, okay to indulge. Everybody, enjoy yes, the rest I of your day. Sure. Sheba, thank you so much oh, for thank joining you for us. Having me. This a lot of fun. And you came out a perfect day because now we get to celebrate. All right, enjoy the rest of your day. Take some time and enjoy the sun coast view. Thank you.